Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to get rid of the useless emoji suggestions on the swipe keyboard. Now I know useless is a strong word to use there but it's true the emoji suggestions in the newest version of swipe don't help anyone. Even if you're one to use emojis frequently swipes implementation is almost impossible to predict. Basically you type words in and hope that an associated emoji is one of the suggestions. Then if you're like me and don't really utilize emojis, all these suggestions are doing is occupying space that could be put to better use. This quote unquote feature was added in a recent update to the Play Store release of Swipe, so this only applies if you're using the latest version. But developer Arpris has created an exposed module that will remove all of these pointless emoji suggestions. That means you'll need to be rooted with the exposed framework installed to get this one going. But if you need any help with that stuff, just check out my full tutorial to link in the description below. Then to get started, Head to the download section of your exposed installer app and search swipe no emoji and that's all one word. From here just tap the top result then swipe over to the versions tab and hit the download button next to the most recent entry. Within a few seconds Android's installer interface should come right up so tap install on this screen. When that's finished you'll get a notification from exposed telling you that the module hasn't been activated yet and that a reboot is needed. Just tap the Activate and Reboot button on this notification and Expose will take care of the rest for you. When you get back up, no further setup is needed. Just bring up any text input field and swipe out a word that would previously cause emojis to be suggested. As you can see, the useless emojis are gone from Swipe's suggestion list and instead you've got more room for actual word suggestions. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!